Reading comprehension is a complex process that involves vocabulary, meaning-making strategies and decoding. At kindergarten, children can build their vocabulary and their meaning-making strategies while they're still learning basic decoding skills. For students who are learning in English as an additional language, it's crucial to find ways to enable them to participate in the rich oral discussions where meaning making is going on and where vocabulary is being developed. Yes, sir. He's walking up the hill and what are they doing? They're walking down, down the hill. Can you count how many there are? One, One two, three, four, five, five six, six, seven, seven eight, eight. Nine. Nine. And what are they called? What do they look like? Soldiers. Yeah, well done. For most children, becoming aware of the features of written language requires more than simple immersion in a print-rich environment. It requires intentional teaching. For children who are becoming literate in English as an additional language, it is important also to use intentional teaching to draw attention to similarities and differences between English and the other languages they are learning to read and write. Good girl, keep going. Up and around. Good. And this one? And this one? Yes. Phonological awareness, including knowledge of syllables, rhyme and individual sounds, is linked to reading skills. At the kindergarten level, for all children, including children who use English as an additional language, it's important to find engaging language that's meaningful and fun activities that enable children to build these abstract skills. What are they now? Chicks! Chicks! Well, let's count them. Mm -hmm.